Hello. How's it going, everyone? Now, I just, like, thought of randomly starting a stream. So, today, we're gonna be doing some, some fun stuff. We're gonna be talking about a lot of things, actually. Because, um... I recently, some of you may not know, but I recently got a job, so I'm very busy these past few days. But I'm trying to crunch in as much time as I can for the project. But how is everyone doing today? How are you guys doing? It's a, it's a wonderful Tuesday. How are you guys doing? Anybody starting school lately? I think there's a bunch of people already, you know, starting school because it's September. It's the back to school month. Last month was some some people you know, back to school. But, uh, on my side, it shouldn't be buffering. If it is, I could just hmm, I'd have to change a few settings here. I'm on New York at the moment. I'm not dropping any frames though. Hey, what's up? I am not Bilal. Alex, what's up? How am I? I'm doing alright. I'm doing alright. Vexus, how's it going? How's it going, guys? How's it going? So I've been working on some stuff lately. Right now, this is fairly broken because it's really early on. But, um... Yeah, lots of, uh... Lots of stuff I'm trying to get in. I haven't really been able to work too much as of lately, but, uh, lots of planning, that sort of thing. I don't really want to do too much landscape because that will kill the stream. Watching from Italy, whoa, wow, let me, uh, lower the volume of this. a bit better this is your first live stream that you're tuning in wow welcome this is the first time i actually post from uh on uh, on the facebook and stuff on the youtube and all that fun jazz i usually whenever i go live i just go live i don't really <laughs> don't really post anywhere i'm watching from your dungeon Shh, don't tell anyone Can't keep secrets, man. Mmm. Uh, I got myself a good cup of coffee. I'm ready for the day. But, uh, yeah, some of you may not have seen, um, if you haven't wa watched the stream and stuff. Um, we have been working on a lot of stuff. Uh, I have some stuff set up. I just have to work on some, uh, interface goodies, which is... It's, it's getting there. Oh, that's the wrong button. Oh, I quit. That was an accident. But, um... A lot of, uh, fun stuff coming in. I did a lot of visual stuff, for the most part. Um, I fixed up some lighting. Uh, as you can see, the world is kind of shaping. We're getting some, some temporary meshes in here. Uh, I do want to get that, that look of, like, a rock in the sky. So, uh, hopefully that'll be coming in soon. Um, I'm gonna have to do some really fancy material stuff for that to get the clouds to look good and that sort of stuff. Watching from Uruguay. Wow. There's people coming from from everywhere. Good old moldy country of Britain. Oh, man. Very talented 3D modeler. Oh, thank you, man. Hope I can get as good in the future. Hey, man. Just gotta practice, practice, practice. Everybody's from different countries. That's awesome. Finland. Seems like there's uh, people from everywhere. How's the queen doing? But uh, other th other than that, um, I'm getting the interface stuff going. I have to concept the items and equipment screen, um, and then we'll be able to go go along with that. Of course, I've been working on options for testers because some people don't have the best of computers, so. Um, pretty much made it compatible for everyone, so there's that as well. Um, 
Am I going to fix the way the HP bar uh, shakes everywhere? Well, it's one of the things that I've been adding in, but I'm going to be changing it, so it's only happening when you're attacking and stuff. So, um... A lot of the stuff I gotta fix, but, you know, it's it's coming in at some point. Um, I will be adding a button so people can disable that, of course. I'm watching from International Space Station. Oh, is that, that's amazing, dude. I, I wish I could be there. How are you doing, Root Killer? Shield is fine. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be working on sound effects at some point um, for uh, the UI and stuff. Um, there's a lot of stuff coming in that I have planned if you guys don't know you can actually watch when I'm not live streaming I do update this like completely this is legitimately our whole um, right here this is how we organize stuff so you guys can all look at this uh, updated as it works so um, so yeah we do have Wi-Fi here that's amazing it's a better Wi-Fi than, than what I have Keeping all my dungeon people there. Oh god. I am. That's where I keep everyone. But, uh, yeah, we have a lot of stuff that w we need to work on. Um, here, let me just open up. We could do some modeling today, or we could do some mechanics. I'll just show you guys what we've been mainly adding in and stuff. Um, walking through the world. Yo, what's up, Squid? How are you doing, man? But, uh, which button was it? Okay. Oh, here we go. So we got the little social area kind of set up. Um, this is pretty much where everybody's going to be uh, getting into parties. If you don't have any friends, you'll be able to come here and other people can kind of add you and that sort of thing. You'll be able to sit in chairs and just pretty much set up whatever you want. Um, I am going to be setting up a whole document pretty much for planning out what we want. Will I add NPC waifus? Oh god. There will be companions. Um, there will be. Just at the moment, I, I'm not working on that yet. But, um... Yeah, a lot of mechanic stuff. Uh, what buttons do I have here? Okay, so there's the UI. I made it so you can change your name again. Oh. And, uh... Some surprises coming, of course. Let me just fly out of here. So I do want to retexture the center area and add a bit of detail to it. It's not exactly um, to my liking, but uh, there is also. I don't think I've shown any screenshots of this. This is fairly early on, so I, I guess we'll work on this today as we uh, as we stream. We're gonna be working on the player black market. Which is pretty much, people will come in. Let's just uh, run over here, or we'll speed through. And then there'll obviously be like, ramps and nice stuff around, so then you can get down. Oh, I don't have collision working yet. Don't mind me, I'm a professional. So this is pretty much where people can um, rent out a market stall. So you could rent this out every, I don't know how many minutes or whatever, you pay. And people can come in here and buy stuff. I don't really know the mechanics of this just yet. There's going to be a bunch of stuff. Obviously, people will be able to walk around on their own. But these will have, like, kind of advertisements on the top. Kind of like in MapleStory, so you don't have to spam stuff. You can just have something on the top here. People can easily come in. There will be, like, a little box around so they can open up an interface. Steal the market stall. Oh, man. It runs out, and you're just like, no! There goes all your stuff. No, probably not. That, that probably won't happen. So there's the more expensive market stalls in the middle here that would probably have bigger advertisements. There can be a clock here. There can be a lot of fun stuff. I've been working on this just a little bit as I as I go. Um, just a couple things that I want to change in terms of visuals. Obviously, I want to add some some new roads and stuff to make it look nicer. So that's going to be coming in. Um, you guys have obviously seen the church. Probably a couple ch uh, quests will be found here. Just have the clock you'll just rent out the clock is that all you'll do 
So this I've been working on as well. There's a couple of things that I do want to change with it. There's a lot of things I want to change and make better, obviously, but I just have to go with the flow, right? And then as I go, I, I change stuff. So um, the church, the beautiful church. I uh, got some nice trees and you can just chill here and stuff. So that's nice. And these past few days, I've been just kind of working on setting up the whole floor. Yeah, it's just... So obviously you won't really be able to see the outside, but I just still wanted to add that kind of detail in. Am I going to do signs? 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 Well, there will be like interfaces showing stuff and there will be like signs showing streets probably so you know where you're going. But uh, yeah. But yeah, I'm mostly setting up how the map is looking. So there's the town set up, there's the starting city, and um, pretty much just planning everything. So there's the labyrinth, uh, which is pretty much going to the next floor and all that fancy stuff. I still have to texture it. So, um, so uh, a lot to do, but it's, it's coming, it's coming along. When will mobs come? That is on the list of things that I do need to do. And hopefully uh, soon I'll be able to add that in. Um, but we're focusing on combat first. So that's why there's the training dummies that I kind of just set up here. And then um, I'll be able to to uh, play around with the combat, add uh, special skills and all that kind of fun stuff. Which is in design stages. And uh, I got another artist in who's working on another floor. It's really early work in progress. And it's going to be an, a later floor. Let me see if I can find a screenshot for you guys. Um, so there's multiple floors kind of in progress. Uh, da -da -da -da. Here, let me find a nice screenshot. I did a few mountains and stuff for the backdrop. Uh, can't really find one. Oh. Okay, I can't find it. I have a very early screenshot, but I don't really want to show it. Because it's very early. Let's see. Yeah, exactly. Mobs would be, uh, would have AI and stuff, so I I'm definitely gonna have to work through that. Let's see if I missed any questions. Do -do -do -do. Yeah, m more than one floor is in progress. It's not floor two, but, uh, but yeah. So at the moment, our only mobs we have is the, uh, the training dummies, which can kind of be hit and stuff. Um, I've been working on it and making it more responsive because some hits don't actually register. So that's going to have to be fixed and then multiplayer is uh, is coming in. So there's that. There's a few things that I do have to fix for that as well. So you can't hit it twice and it dies twice. And uh, I do have two different attack animations. So there's that one and this one. Which would obviously be for different weapon types, would have different basic combats. And some people suggested that I have skills or whatever that would change the basic combat, so hopefully um, I'll look into that. That means more animations that I have to have create, but uh, it'll come. Um, I do have player characters in progress. They're naked at the moment, so I can't really show them, but um, they're getting there. I should make the dummies have infinite health. I could definitely do that. It's floor 69 ready. Oh, no. No, not at all. How will combat work in VR? Um, we're not exactly looking at VR compatibility just yet. Um, I don't know if some people are confused by that, but we're not doing a VR yet. Like, and I don't even know if we will. At the moment, we're just focusing on a PC game. Some people have suggested it, and I kind of thought about it. But for me to do VR, I'd have to have a VR. 
I don't have a VR, so someday. Um, someday that'll come. Um, and I am working on making it so you can enter buildings. I do have to do some edits to it so you actually physically go in the building so people don't see you. Because multiplayer is a bit buggy at the moment, but, um, well, hey, progress. So, let's see what we can do today. There's a few things I do need to do. And that I need. Who is rich here? Oh man, dude, VR is expensive. It's very expensive. What is it, like $800 now? Okay. So, I can actually show you guys our list. How, how we organize some of our stuff. So... Here's our combat GDD. I'm not really scared of showing this kind of stuff. It's not really that big of a deal. Um, this is still like completely work in progress and I'm just like writing stuff as I go. And there's going to be more things that I write down. But uh, yeah, there's, there's a lot of design and planning that needs to be done before we actually start going into it. Patreon. I don't really want to accept money just yet. Um, someday, maybe. But I've tried to do a Patreon before for my 3D designs, and it didn't really go well. So someday, maybe once we get more stuff into the game, I don't want to accept money yet because then that would be essentially stealing money. So um, we could do. Um, hmm. Let's take a look here. We could essentially work on a building, which would be fun. Or we could do some UI designs. We could just, we could pretty much do anything. 2115, what is that? Just, uh, just get my calculator out here. Uh, 21 minus 12. Uh, oh, 9! 9, 9 p.m. <laughs> oh, man. A chest? We could do a chest. Alright, so let's go with concept slash referencing. Alright, let's make a chest. Wheels. I, I don't know if many people would, would donate, but who knows some if i get enough stuff in that i feel proud of it and that i feel like somebody would maybe throw some money at it maybe but uh but uh yeah but anyways let's just uh i'm gonna close this really quickly and we're gonna open up blender i'm gonna get some references for a chest Make a nice fancy chest. We're gonna just go with a normal chest for now, and then, and then we'll do a, a low tier chest. PC specs. I think my PC specs are down below, but I have the usual setup. I7, 4790. I think it is. GTX 780. <clears throat> okay. And I think I, the only thing that's different is 16 gigabytes of RAM. All right. So let's just go with the, go with the flow. Cause I, I can't, I kind of have an idea in my head of how I can go about doing a chest. We're just gonna do a simple small chest, not too crazy. So if any of you ever tuned into my stream when I do 3D modeling, this is pretty much the gist of it. I'm just doing stuff, talking with you guys, having fun. Um, but uh, yeah, nothing, nothing crazy, you know, just chilling out. Blend file. 
fun. How much fun? We're talking about like 99.5% of fun. And we're going to have breaks in between as well. To, um, so that I can split the video because that's uh, how I'm going to be doing it now is pretty much splitting the video at breaks like two minute breaks very short breaks I think I checked out your uh, your sketch fab before it's not too bad it's not too bad We'll give out money left and right to make some sort of game to start out quicker. I guess so. Some people, uh, I guess, really want something like this. So, I'm wondering if I want to make it like a square chest or a, a curved top chest. I guess for this one, we could do a square chest. We'll get an inside in here. Start out with a, sh a basic shape of a box. So we got that going. And what I can do here is probably screw these edges here. Make different rated chests? That is actually on the plan right here. We got, we're, we're doing this one at the moment. Here, I'll put a little light here. Red. Am I gonna make a launcher for the game? Uh, at the moment, it's not on as a focus, but at some point, maybe. Yeah, we got we got all that stuff going. This is just a normal chest that probably won't be opened. Actually, now that I think about it, won't be opened. Mm. Don't really need this, do I? Then. Uh, let's see here. Here, we'll, we'll make this a curved one. Simple shape for now. Okay, so what we want to do here is uh, I'll enlarge this a little bit, and let me just quickly get a reference of a chest. We want to make it kind of like a simple chest, not something crazy. So, let's go on ahead here. And we'll mirror it. I haven't been modeling much lately because of work, but. Uh, my hands are kind of getting used to it again. This one's probably going to be some iron trimmings on it. On the edges. Okay, 
So for this one, I just kind of want to go along the edges here. Um, at the moment, chests are going to be more of um, rarity, so what's inside. Um, but there won't be classes, remember, so people can essentially go with whatever they want to do. They can do speed with a spear or whatever, and that sort of thing, right? So, um, that's, uh, that's one of the things that can be a bit confusing. Alright, so now we want to inverse. Could probably do this in a much easier fashion, but uh, oh well. A trap chest? That's a. We could possibly do that. That is a possibility. We could possibly get some uh, some trap chests, and that would be that would be funny though. <laughs> Somebody opens the chest, and well, bam! Thirty million mobs out of nowhere. Because why not? Thirty million is a perfect number. I don't know why this beveled in probably the worst way possible. Oh man, food is going to be a, a fun thing to do, uh, because I have a, a pretty good plan of how I want to do cooking, so uh, there will probably be some rare foods that you'll be able to make. This will pretty much be Gordon Ramsay Simulator 2016, 2018, 2022, I don't know when this game will come out, who knows. Simulator. Imagine that. Somebody makes a shop and it's a cooking shop. Oh man. <laughs> oh man, that's gonna be a doozy. God dang. This was beveled terribly. I'm embarrassed. Will we be able to get- oh man, that's fucked up. Will we- will we- Alex is asking, uh, will we be able to kill people, gather their body parts, and make my own waifu? Um, I don't want to be like No Man's Sky and say you'll be able to do things, but yes. No. That's, uh, it's a very vicious way of doing things. Um, uh, uh that's, uh, I'll think about it. I'll think about it for that one. That's a question I will have to think about. Okay, so uh, I want to fix this a little bit because, as you can tell, it doesn't exactly have the curvature that I like.
think about it. 2016. I am doing it in real life. That's also fucked up. Oh, man. Alright, I'm on. Not gonna be able to come back from that one. Okay, we've got some back faces here. That is a waste. Don't need that. Nice. There we go. Makes absolutely no sense. But hey. Oh, okay. Let's, uh, let's go back a little bit here. I know exactly what went wrong. Okay, never mind. This is odd. I'm the confuzzled human. Pre-alpha key? Should we do a giveaway today? Hmm. Hmm. The way I, I made this chest is going to be absolutely annoying to work on. Because I curved it and everything, it's just like, eh. Okay, you know what? Let's, uh, let's quickly redo this. Because obviously, I'm very bad at things. Alright, so let's start from the beginning here. Let's go on ahead, and let's say we want an edge along the chest. We first probably want to fix up the curvature of this. Correct. Let's go on ahead here and do that. It looks very sexy. Oh, that's good, actually. That's good. I thought some people would be kind of angry that I'm not going along with the old SAO interface. I didn't really like the SAO interface. I have some trouble with it. Okay, there's our first portion. So, now that I have this, let's go on ahead and going to bevel this. That's a lot better than the older version. Control I. Oh, whoops. I'm going to delete those faces. And then I'm going to add... What was it? Oh man, solidify, there we go. There we go. Still a bit screwed up, but we can fix that. <laughs> what? Oh man. You can't turn off the game. If you do, your computer blows up. That's a very good thing to do. That's how you market a game. Uh, it completely bricks your computer.
I like the sound of that. I should hire you. We're getting somewhere. Wasn't really getting anywhere before. When is the next stream? Uh, I could probably do it the same time next week, perhaps. Because tomorrow I have work for the next four days, so... Hey, what's up, Nightwing? How's it going, man? idea what happened there but that's okay because it, we don't care about that face that one as well Oh, yeah, we're working on that right now, as a matter of fact. Why is there a twist going on there? I'm absolutely confused. Bevel really screwed up a lot of things, didn't it? I know there's something wrong with this curvature right here. There we go. A public test would be nice. Um. Uh, hmm. I'd have to think about it, to be honest. I'd have to, yeah. Seems really broken, goodness gracious. I have never made a broken thing like this before. Like, I even have AOA's chest still. It's interesting how I'm having so much trouble with this. I got rusty. I kind of did. I feel it feels like that.
Like, let's say I went over here. Change this to this instead. Easily can make it this chest. Well, this is a simple chest anyways. I don't want to go too fancy with it. See, this bevel is a bit odd how it works. So I'm just going to... Sometimes manually is better than anything. a bit. game launcher with an auto update that's something I do want to do because some people kind of have to just download it from the uh, the game jolt website that's pretty much how things work at the moment and some people don't like doing that but uh, at some point I do want to make a launcher I think that'll make everybody's life easier GGO hype. I actually, uh, I don't know if many of you guys know, but I actually was working on a GGO type game before. It was a. It was, nah, yeah. <clears throat> I kind of did three different iterations. Um, so there's that. Um, but yeah. This was the voxel idea, which was actually uh, kind of getting somewhere, sort of. There was another version, which was Cyber Online, and then there was Fate of Glocken. I don't think I have any screenshots of those things anymore, though. I don't think I do, because I think I, uh, I should have deleted it. I deleted all of it. I didn't like it. There's, there's probably somewhere you could probably see the images, but right now uh, they're all gone. They've, they've disappeared. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna focus on GGO. I, I, it's just yeah. I feel like, uh, just need a little, just needs a 